Hello everybody, and welcome back to City Emotions 2. Today we are going to be continuing on. Today we're going to be building another route, uh, something new. We're going to build the water boat. Or was it known as the water bus in here, as you can see. Today we're going to build a route for that. Um, since you've been away, you may notice there is uh, electric buses now coming down to the bay. That follows this route all the way up. Pretty much going straight up. Uh, pretty much going straight up, following, and then, well, diverges off here, and just ends here, just to add another service down to the bay. Um, the metro line has another depot, where it splits off here, because I've made this lovely junction, you can see here, double line. You can see the track, see the monorails crossing over it then. Uh, beautiful, like, I think this improved the monorail services, so I can then, um, <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, instead of doing, um, originally there was only I could only have a half an hour service on both routes, uh, either way they're going, because the um, they were sharing the same platforms and everything like that. Uh, now I just um, can have a 15 minute run on both routes. Uh, as you can see, it's all lovely crisscrossing. Um, and be able to improve services along this whole thing uh, and it's moving people much better improving our rep from just that um, but yeah that was a bit of a faff that used a lot of my skills to uh, build let's say that much uh, I'm glad I did it off camera because there was a few times where I did it wrong and I had to restart this uh, again you may also notice there's another metro service that runs pretty much east to west uh, so it starts over here, goes right across, and ends over here. <coughs> so yeah, this time we're going to go and turn around to build a... We're going to build the water bus. And I'm thinking of building it from here. So at least then it connects up with the Cardiff Bay area. And it'll come all the way over to here. To the Ponaf area of the Cardiff. And then we'll also build a bus that will go from Ponaf all the way into the city centre so then there's also a bus service that will go right in as well uh, just to bring in more uh, passengers pretty much which is what's needed oh yeah I should also say I did also put another bus route over here uh, you may also just see it now um, I had problems with when I saved this game last time uh, as you remember from what we had I should do that now and just uh, I'll put it under that one at the moment. Yep. Should be a bit. There we go. I had problems when saving the game last time. Um, it didn't save, so I had to redo what we had done in the last uh, video. And so when I before I did that, I built this route instead of the one we built going up here. So you'll notice the numbers are different. Uh, due to that <laughs> so yes like I said let's get, let's get on to building the uh, water bus so the first thing we need to do is go over here click on the thing and we need to build a depot now this is important to look to see where you put your depot um, because you've got to be able to the water bus has to be able to find the from the depot to the station uh, without you know quite easily because you're fine it is a pig that it doesn't like finding it so we're gonna put it I'm gonna put it here um, and then we are we're gonna turn around we'll put the water boat here so people can come off there off the train off the metro or the trolley bus and be able to catch that and I'm gonna put it right here over on the beach There we go. So now we go. We, we're now going to run a service that will just run back and forth from there. So the next thing we need to do, we probably will need to put waypoints. Now this is where waypoints come in more important than any of the other times you've ever used it. So first of all, we'll do one there and have to look to see what matches up. So we'll put one there. We'll do the same here. And we'll put one here 
So there we go, we now have put waypoints. Now, the reason I've done it like this, because you probably find you'll have more than one water bus running, and if you put it as the same waypoints, they will collide uh, as they're going around. So the next thing let's do is correct the route. So let's go along, close it, of course, from service. So we'll click onto the depot, and straight to the stop. Now the first thing I'm going to do is go to this waypoint, this waypoint, and then into depot. Because you'll notice if I do it from there, it doesn't recognize the route. So then we'll go back to that waypoint, back to there, and into depot. So there we go, we pretty, pretty much zigzags itself across. Now you also got to be careful because sometimes it may mess up with here. I might have gone, let me just have a look. If I could get rid of that waypoint, I wonder if I could just... No, it don't work. So if I... Hang on, let's just get rid of this. Put another waypoint in. Um, put another waypoint here, just to... So the boat that's coming in, the boat coming out, doesn't collide with the boat coming in. So there we go, we go like that, over, over, in, over, over, and in. So they're pretty much going in the same line, but one will stop more than the other, so, unless I move the thing, hang on, let's move that. Let's put it there, so we know it's not going to be affected. There we go. So now we know that one boat will come, when it's coming here, will ease this way and the other one will go straight along there. So there we go, that's pretty much done. Next thing to do is just have a look at our timetable. I'm pretty much happy with a two hourly. Um, I can't, the water boat takes a while for it to build up, I tell you that for sure. Um, we'll leave it a three hourly over the weekend and a three hourly overnight. Because um, like I said, it, it takes a while for it to build up. So next thing to do is after we've done all that, let's uncouple that from that. Turn around and have a look to see how many water boats we need. Three. So let's have a look on down to find a good water boat. Now we want one that will, um, you'll find a lot of the boats have all got pretty much excellent or good acceleration. So you don't have to worry about the acceleration. It's more you're looking at how much it costs, uh, how many people it takes, service quality, and also the how long it takes to be down. You'll find the prices vary as well um, as you go along. As always but I tend to go for generally either this one or this one um, you'll find as you notice that it's 50 50 pound more for this one uh, except this one's got better acceleration this one's well, more seat never more seats than the other one uh, but uh, it's down more than this one well, except on diesel down more on repair. Uh, diesel consumption is more than this one, uh, but it's got better acceleration and better service quality. Now we're looking at that at the moment, so we'll have three of them. Purchase done, and the next thing to do is open it. So there we go. That is our water boat. That's how you'd make a water boat route. It's a bit more complicated than others because you've got to put these. Um, Wayne Mark is in. Uh, if you don't, it, it doesn't work. Uh, they don't like working at all. They, you know, you know, unless your station is there and there, it's fine. But if you've got more than one service on there, you'll find it gets stuck a lot. So yeah, you'd have to put it on the thing. I should also say, you may also notice from the the metro trains are different on this line um, than what I put on in the video. Uh, I've moved the ones that was on the video on the east to west and made these ones even bigger uh, capacity than the ones that was on there originally. Uh, this is pretty much the same price. Um, it's only slight difference. I think it was only a uh, £50 difference in price for each one. But I thought, but it's the same uh, acceleration and everything like that. The, uh, I think it goes down more with the other ones. Uh, it costs more to repair. But I thought, 
it with the longer route, it's better off having more capacity than than none at all. So that's that done. Um, the next thing we're going to do is put our bus, do our bus route, which I said we're going to do, and that's going to come from Penarth all the way into the sea. So the next thing we're going to do is come around, let's get a large bus stop. I'm going to build it here on the beach. I'm put two by the beach, so we'll have one for the long haul and one for just local running, of course. So uh, next thing to do is start putting our bus stops down. Ooh, that's close. It's nearly got that. Uh, it might count it uh, as it's in the ring it's got in that villa that's the, this ta uh no not that one. This one. Connect the villa by one line. That might just do it. So we may finish an achievement there. So let's build our route going along. Um, I'm going to have it going up here. Yeah, both sides much follow each other all the way up. Uh, we're going along the main roads because um, this is the main bus service that's runs in the area. I may put the other one down here just to add that extra bit. I'll put that there and if I put the other one I put the other one here, so it goes. It, has to come, it goes in and stops those shops. At least then it'll improve on services there. We'll have a bus stop here. It's a nice bit of housing up here in here. <coughs> Hopefully, I'll do my local bus service that will come around, connect a lot of this, uh, connect it up with the metro and, ev and our bus service now uh, we're building, and it will just improve uh, the running of most of the area. Um, We'll probably bring it in here, just we'll just bring it in so it connects up. We'll both stop there pretty much. Now we can see the traffic's quite busy around here, so we probably won't bother like stopping anywhere along by here, just because it could go in the this lane here and just avoid. Put a stop there so it could just connect up with this. Now you can see we've got a lot of traffic along here, so we may have to deal with some new roads and everything. But at the moment, we'll just, just push it along. Now we just go right up the main street. <coughs> Excuse me. Connect it with the other bus stop by there. Put that there. Put that there. So we see we're just pretty much heading into the city centre. A uh, slight different way than the metro does. I'm going to change the bus stops into the nicer ones now. much in the city centre now. Now we've got a choice, we'll either go along here with the metro and then up here, or we'll go up here. I think we'll go up here. Um, we'll add a different route in pretty much. So we've got the bus route that runs pretty much there. Uh, we'll run it in the same pretty way, same way as uh, the thing, and I'll just which I'll do, throwing you about here, aren't I? Sorry about that. We'll go along here, just as the normal, and we'll put a bus stop here, a bus stop here. So we'd loop around at this top end here, and then go back. Um, so yeah, I think that'll do us with this bus service. Probably be a very long bus service. Uh, so the next thing to do is we just put the, um, create the line. Bus route 7, we're doing very well on the bus routes. And um, we'll, um, we'll start from this one here. So we'll just 
click and connect it all the way along. Oops, so our price is a bit too high, I'll have to deal with that in a bit. Now we know there's going to be quite a bit of traffic problems along this route, so one thing I'm going to do is try to sort that out now before um, we come operating services. Um, the reason is, is it makes your life a lot easier when you, when you operate the service. So I'm just going to put the route in first, like we are now. And then I'll just come back, sort out the services. It's got a nice little, uh, pretty much a straight line. You can see, well, it's not going to show it on the map, which is a shame. Normally it does. Um, but yeah, we'll just come along. Back here. Not enough vehicles and trolley bus one. But one, obviously, there's a backlog somewhere. I'll have to go and look for that as well in a bit later on. So there we go, that's our route. So it would do, it's giving us our grant and money because of the um, it just connected it up. Got another little challenge, just read what it says. Uh, purchase one bus, well we can do that. Purchase one tram, trolley bus, and one metro. We'll do that as we speak. I'm quite happily doing that. First of all, they turn around and said about trolley bus line one, wasn't it? Um, let's have a look. Uh, trolley bus depot one. Do that. So we go. We've purchased one of that. Should have counted that. But we'll uh, see. If we done, I'll take it out and redo it again. But right, first of all, let's go and sort this route out. Let's get rid of the line, so we don't want to don't want that blinding us constantly. And the first thing I'm going to do is, yeah, pretty much demolish that. Get a new road. I think we'll go for that. A bit bigger. So there we go. bit more capacity on the road by there. That should ease a lot of traffic a bit more. And we'll, we'll see if we can do it here. It's just... Uh, it's a silly road coming off here. We'll demolish that. We'll see if we can put another... Oh, hang on. That's the wrong type of road, to be honest. Uh, we just want a normal road. Normal road. There it is. So there you go, pretty much adds a bus route all the way in. So that should ease a lot of the traffic, at least it can run now on a bus on, it, on its own service. Um, pretty much there's a bus all the way in. Uh, should have no problems at all, all the way along here. It probably ease its way, they'll swap over by there pretty much. Uh, but yeah, it'll run all the way fine. Now let's go and sort this bit out. I'm thinking I may do a flyover. Uh, so we do that. We'll do it like. Oh no, wrong one. Let's move that up there a bit. I can actually see a bit better. So if I do that. Now the road will fly over, the buses could fly over the top of the traffic jam.
So we go. The buses will now not get affected by um, the traffic now. It should hit, should ease a lot of it. And we'll just put that as a normal. We just have a look, see if the buses do do that. If not, I will reroute it. Well, I might just reroute it anyway. I'll put a waypoint here. I'll put a waypoint here. Uh, and we'll add these waypoints. So there you go, that makes that tells the buses that they've got to go over that. Saves it going in through all that traffic there. But that should ease that junction in general. Because uh, it's now a bit better. Uh, it's been a bit done a bit better. Right, so the next thing we need to do, as always, uh, click on the depot, essentialize that south back there. First of all, actually, I forgot to do, let's do the timetable. I'm just going to copy bus route 1, um, as we know that's a pretty standard one uh, for running from the intercity. So we need 21 buses. Uh, I'm going to turn around and go straight into the, into the uh, Roadmaster 2000 buses, or otherwise known as the Boris bus, and buy a load of them straight away, and we'll open the line as it's late at night, and so that's done pretty much. So yeah, that's easy enough. Now we can see the boat's going well. Uh, two people on the one going inwards, uh, no one on the other side, but that should improve our services um, on the whole running. Uh, as you can see, the water, the buses and the water tax boat on this side uh, also meet up, especially it meets up that side as well. So that should ease this whole, like people could come down here now to come over to Bath instead of taking the railway line or the train line or the bus route. And then it can all connect, it all pretty much connects up. It just adds another route in. Uh, so you're not over congesting like one service, you are like improving many services. Um, let's turn around and accepted our thing. We need one tram. Uh, obviously there's a problem with tram depot one so we'll click on that. I oh, can easily do that. We'll just add the one into it. So accepted that, accepted that. We just need to buy one more metro. Uh, where should we have the metro trained? Well, I think I might get a normal service because in the end I want to build another line from here so it connects all this up as well. Uh, so we'll have a. I might actually put the depot in now and we'll put the train in that depot. So, how much is that going to delete? That's not too bad. I can get away with that. Uh, we'll turn around. Let's get the depot. So it's, it's nice to do the challenges sometimes when you get the challenge like that. Uh, easy, easy challenge uh, when they give you little tasks like that. And we'll just turn around, go on there, turn around. As you can see, they're, they're cheaper, the other ones, but they they get more maintenance, uh, more electric than what we are using. But just as good acceleration, a bit better service quality, uh, but more seats, end of the day. So let's click there. There we go, that's done. Easy bit of money there. So, that's pretty much it for that, so this is, um, there we go, done, that's that challenge done and dusted. Uh, let's have a look at the time, well we've got a bit of time left, we could go and start doing, um, what shall I do next, uh, let's go to the little service buses around this area, uh, let's just try and make the, um, let's go and try and improve services in the area. Um, if we could do proof services in the area, at least then we can um, have a good running. Um, at least then we can have the city running quite nicely. So we'll put bus service stop there. We'll, we'll zigzag this one. So it's just all it is. It's just to connect up as you can see the dots are just it's all it is is just to um, get the ring around every single place I'll put the bus bus stop by there just so then it connects up with the water boat and that's it for that one 
So that's, that literally just turns around and gets all this bit here. Uh, we'll send another bus service, I'll get all the other bits. Just all it will do is just add extra services on the route uh, and the water boat and everything like that and just brings better connection. So then this area would then turn around instead of thinking, oh, let's take our cars. They would think, oh, the public transport connects us up here. We could take public transport. Um, let's quickly go and turn around and build another route. Route number eight. So we're getting through these routes. Um, we'll get it out of that depot. Goes there, there, there. Just remember it zigzags. Pretty much goes around. There you go, that's quite a simple little route. That probably won't need hardly any buses to run on it. Quite a simple little route like that. Uh, be an easy runner. Um, and then later on, we'll get another bus that probably stop here, starts here, and then we'll go around all this area here, or goes here, and then runs up to this bit here. We'll go up, do all that bit, and then come back down. Uh, that should then connect up that, and then we'll do a final bus service that pretty much comes up. Maybe go around, do all this, comes around here, and then back to depot. So, uh, we've still got time, so we could do all that. Uh, timetable, uh, well, we'll get rid of the morning rush. Uh, we don't want that. Uh, we'll leave that as, we'll bring that down to two hourly. And we'll finish it at 10 o'clock. Um, night. Yeah, we'll leave it at that, pretty much. I, I can't see us uh, doing too much on that. Uh, we need three buses to run it. Uh, we'll go back to our normal buses we normally get, uh, which is the Comet. But I, I don't know, I may go for the Evo here. Let's just think. The same price, and uh, that gets more for people, doesn't it, at the end of the day. So let's put three buses. There we go. Done and dusted. Open that up. So there we go. That's bus route eight done. So at least now they can't... We have another route around this whole thing. That guy's got another <laughs> route connecting his uh, house. You can't complain about that. Uh, let's go along to the other route I was going to set about. So we'll go along here. We connect up that way. So it varies, it varies the uh, where we go in. So we just go around here. So it's quite a big estate this bit. So we'll, we'll have a few bus services coming up here. Another one does the rest of it. You don't want to over one make one bus service do too much, um, just because it would take too long for it to get around. It'd be better if I did that way. Uh, it's not connecting much around there now, but uh, I can sort that out. Um, come down. It's hard to connect up those houses at the end. Uh, obviously, won't be able to do it properly there. Put that there. That's so now it connects up to that. It comes down. It comes down by the metro station. Yeah, that'll do. So it zigzags all around that area. So that connects up with the metro station more than anything. Uh, that should improve services around that area as well. So more people will take the metro train than that before than they, what they are now. Uh, we can see the um, traffic is a lot lighter around this area now since uh, we've done this whole like 
rescheduling the uh, services around the area. Not enough water boats. Oh, well, there should be. So where are they? This is one, two. Okay. Yes, we'll stick another one in there. Obviously, they're not. Sometimes you'll find that it just randomly changes. I think it's because it's mostly because the way they they all go along. Right, my name is Mr. Uh, Don Rump, and I've got just one piece of advice for you: location, location, location. The strategy placement of the transport lines can be made make businesses, and the city grows. I'm looking to improve. Let's see if you can do better than my last attempt. They they weren't, weren't up for the challenge of revitalizing the city just north of here. Um, grow population 5% up to 106,000. Establish 52% coverage. Right then, that's going to be a challenge, I'll tell you that for sure, because it's going to be a lot of this, it's got to be covered, and uh, if we cover what we've already got, uh, thing, like, like as we're doing now, um, we'll hit it, but other than that, you're not going to hit that much. Um, I think they should turn around and say, it's coming up to the time when I decide if we uh, continue with this series, or we'll move on to do something else. Um, I'll be doing a poll over the... Oh, wrong way. I'll be doing a poll over the uh, bank holiday weekend um, on my Facebook page, uh, asking people if you want to stay with City Emotions 2. Well, first of all, I'll ask you if you want to stay with City Emotions 2, the Cardiff map, or would you like to move on to um, a different map? Um, and if or you want to stay with, or want to do st see something else instead, then see emotions too. So I'll be asking question. That would be the I'll be asking this uh, very soon um, over the bank holiday weekend. Uh, so that's next weekend. So I should put the poll up very soon. Uh, if anyone watches my train sim videos, you, you should be. Uh, I'll probably turn around to say about it on there that I've put up the poll. Um, uh, and it would be on my Facebook thing. Uh, so it sh I'll try and put it up maybe um, when I put this video up and put it uh, pin it at the top or something like that. So be able to keep our high. But yeah, I'm gonna. I just want to ask you all uh, if people are still watching it and enjoying it, or um, is people just had enough now and want to watch something else or see something else? Um, as you know, I thought I'll ask the question. Um, because I, I don't know if people uh, really want to watch it anymore. Um, uh, Cause I know sometimes I see viewers on these uh, low, and then sometimes I see they're not so bad. Um, so I don't know if people are just, I don't know, not interested in dipping in and out of it or, or what. But I, I thought I'll ask the question, do it to a vote. If, if people are not really interested in it, that's fine. I'll uh, put a different series on. Um, I've been even thinking, like, slowly, but start doing live streams. Maybe on um, on Twitch itself. Um, I don't know if anyone here has Twitch or um, know about Twitch. Uh, it's a live streaming uh, section uh, place. And, you know, I could live stream things like this on on the game on there as well um, so you could find I could live stream uh, this whole um, uh, this game on on there um, uh, instead of doing videos but and other games but yeah I don't know I, I, like I said I'm gonna pull up a poll see what people think uh, I got other games that we could move on to um, there's like well I no, I said it before, there's like Train Fever. Uh, there's a game that I backed not long ago, uh, I don't know if anyone would be interested in that, which is, this is the police storyline, but turn around, 
uh, changes different ways. It depends on how you play the game and this, that, the other. Um, so, yeah, uh, little things like that. But yeah, I thought I'll uh, do little ask, ask the question, uh, see what people uh, fancy. Um, and if people want more videos of this or want to see something different. Um, but yeah, I thought I'll, I'll put up a poll. Uh, see what, what it is and whatever the outcome is, we'll, we'll just do. So yeah, um, we need a bit more of them. But yeah, hopefully... Uh, oh, come on, it's taking ages, this is. It's a bit annoying ding ever, these. Come on, 50%, thank you, done. So let's have a look at that chart. Um, oh, we're making a nice bit of turnover of money now. <laughs> nice bit of turnover. Um, as you can see, the only thing that's not making any money is the water boats, but that'll take a bit. That'll take some time. Uh, better connection and everything like that. That will slowly get itself into the pluses. But as you can see, the, the services are running quite nicely. Um, uh, the most, the one that's given us the most money in profit. Um, is the uh, metro generally is? Uh, it's nice to see the metro is still, uh, the uh, yeah, well, the metro is making us the most. Uh, the monorail has given us a nice tidy bit of money coming in as well, and that's quite good to see. Um, it probably from when I've uh, changed it so it can runs a uh, as it runs a 15 minute service now for most of the day. Um, in the day and at night it's a half an hour. Um, this pretty much improves a lot of it, a lot of th things on the on the run. As now it means just there's more, there's more people, there's more services running, and it just frees up the city itself. Like it's not so congested. Uh, what's the next one? It's giving us the most money. The tram that just beats the trolley bus, and in the buses, uh, it brings in the least of the profits. Uh, it's normally in between the um, the tram, the trolley bus and the metro and you can see they're not um, the tram, the trolley bus and the the normal bus I should say instead of the metro but you can see in their money they're not far between each other. They, there's not a lot in between them so you know I give it some time there could be interesting to see I think more services you open up also affects it like now we've just made more bus services as soon as they start flourishing that will improve um, and the chances are they could go up for the trolley bus the money is going down on the buses at the moment is well it's taken a bit for us, most of these services to start making a profit and as soon as they start making a profit and good amount of profit that will bump them but at the moment it's not so much so like I said I'll get a toll uh, uh, a poll not a toll uh, a poll up over the um, over the bank holiday weekend asking what people like and I'll say the results are on the next no not the next video because the next video will be a bank holiday Monday I won't be able to go on the online so I'll pull up a video anyway I uh, won't be saying what the thing is I'll probably say in that video as well the poll is open because it will stay open that bank holiday Monday as well so uh, so don't worry it will start up on the bank on the weekend and work through right through on the bank holiday Monday I won't close until I get uh, internet because that weekend I'm moving uh, from the flat to the house I lose the internet connections uh, Thursday so I got re I got um, make some videos uh, for the Friday and the uh, Monday quite soon or we <laughs> there may be no videos because uh, I will have no internet uh, but then after that I'll after that I will close the poll see how we get along and uh, say what the results are um, so yeah hopefully hopefully what it, if you've enjoyed this uh, go over to my Facebook follow me on there uh, good idea to follow me on there um, uh, follow me on, yeah, like I said, follow me on there and uh, be able to register your vote. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed. Today we learned so making the uh, water bus. Hopefully that will improve on a lot of services in the end. Um, we have a good running on that. Uh, so when you come back next time, we, we'll see that 
hopefully that will be turning over a nice bit of profit. But we'll, you know, wait and see. Um, if you enjoyed this, please don't forget to put a like in the bottom of the video. I pre greatly appreciate that. Uh, it just tells me that people do enjoy the content that's coming out. Um, if you've maybe watched a few of my videos, haven't done so already, you should see at the bottom there's a little plus, a uh, little bottom of the video there's a little plus or thing saying subscribe uh, it should be around by there um, and quite enjoy it why don't you subscribe uh, subscribe to the channel uh, keep this community alive uh, keep us going um, and yeah it, it much appreciated uh, it shows that there's a lot of support out there to watch a lot of the content that I make uh, like I've just been saying about Facebook, so don't forget you can follow me on Facebook I would advise you to follow me on Facebook if you watch this so register your uh, vote on the poll. Uh, link below in the description, as well as a link to my Twitter. <coughs> Excuse me. So you can keep up to date with all the inf information as well. So I hope you've enjoyed that. And should be another train simulator video probably over the weekend. And uh, maybe OMSI, because I've been messing around with that a lot lately. And I've got it starting to work a bit. So I may have a go for a little test on that. And if I could get it working properly we'll have a video on that so i hope you enjoyed this until next time bye for now <laughs>